Hey guys, Stalvin back, playing some Popper. Uh, we're playing a new deck actually. It's uh, Mono White Tokens. This hand is actually not very good. We're going to have to mulligan this one. This deck doesn't mulligan very often. Uh, this is unfortunate, but it is what it is. Alright, our opponent's playing Plains Thraven Inspector. We're going to play a Plains and pass turn. Um, uh, this deck actually, that was, <laughs> it's usually not like that. My opening hands are usually pretty good. Oh, shout out to Lucas, new subscriber. Thank you for subscribing. Opponent got three Squadron Hawks. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, guys. Man, that sucks. I've done some playtesting with this deck, and it's actually been doing pretty good. We're just going to take this damage here. Opponent plays a core Skyfisher, bouncing back to Thraben Inspector to play it for more clues. It's good value. Well, we don't draw planes, which is extremely unfortunate. Our opponent has all kinds of lands. We are going to trade with the Thraben Inspector here. Block. Ping. Because we wouldn't be attacking with it anyway, really. It's not a good trade-off. Alright, he plays a Squadron Hawk. Really unfortunate that we only have one Planes here. Yeah. We're just not fast enough, guys. This might be a... Uh, I probably shouldn't be scooping that early, but that wasn't going to happen, unfortunately. And I'd rather not give my opponent any more information than he already had. So, against this kind of deck, he's going to be bringing in... Hmm. Let's see, what should I bring in? I think, I think my deck's okay the way it is. Hmm. I think my deck's fine. I think I just need to, I just need to draw better. We get to go first this time. Opening hand is far better this time around. Far, far better. Planes and go. Three bin inspector. Planes, gather the townsfolk. Lone missionary. All right. There is an argument to trade here, but I don't think I'm going to. I don't think I'm at that point yet. Alright, well, Suchi Priest or Townsfolk. Next turn, I can play the Plains, and if I play the Townsfolk this turn, I can use Triplicate Spirit, so I think that's the route I want to take. So we're just going to play Gather the Townsfolk. Uh, do I attack here? For if, Let's see, if I attack and he blocks, I'll have four mana next turn. I can play... Let's see, one, two, I can play the Triplet Spirits for two, and then the Suchu Priest for two. That's if he doesn't block, though. Is one damage worth it? Hmm. I think it's worth the trade here, if he wants to block. I don't think he will, though. I highly doubt he blocks. Yeah, he didn't block. We'll go ahead and pass the turn. The question is, are we going to block? I can go 
triplicate spirits and suture priest next turn if I don't block. That's pretty good. Especially if I draw uh, one of my pump spells like Guardian's Pledge. That'd make it super good. Opponent was going to cast something, but decided not to. I find that interesting. Didn't attack. Okay. Back over to us. Lumen Thread Field. I think we're going to keep with the plan here. I think we're going to go... I think we're going to go Suchi Priest into Spirits. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. Suchi Priest. Spirits. We're going to go... One... Two, three, create a bunch of spirits. Always yes, always yield. We're going to gain a bunch of life here. And pass the turn. Opponent cracks his clue. I'm not going to attack yet. Uh, I'm really looking for a pump spell. Remosian Rally is good. Um... Guardian's Pledge is what I really, really want. Always yield to the damage. I wonder what he's bouncing. The, the Missionary, probably? Yeah. Missionary replays it. Goes to combat. No attacks. Well, I think we're going to go on the Battle Screech plan here. Um, kind of want to play Luma Threadfield, too. Huh. Hmm. I think Battle Screech is going to be the best route. Play it. Flash it back. Tap, tap, tap. Alright. Do we attack? I don't think not yet. Maybe next turn we'll start attacking with our flyers. If I draw, like, a Guardian's Pledge, that's going to be very destructive for the opponent. Crax's Clue. I wonder what he's hunting for. Core Sky Fisher. Takes some damage. Bounces a Thraven Inspector. Plays it to get a Clue. All right. And does he attack? Nope. All right. Planes. That's not what we wanted to see, really. But we'll go ahead and play this face down just to confuse our opponent here. And we gain a life. Do we start attacking here? He can block five. If I attack with everything, I can deal one, two. I can deal one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't think it's worth attacking. Not yet. If we just get a pump spell, we'll be a lot better off. Opponent plays Alchemist Vile. Come on, Guardian's Pledge. That's what we're looking for here. Alright, what do we have here? When he enters the battlefield, detain target creature. Until next turn... That creature can't block or activate abilities. Okay. Spirit. Alright. So, we're looking for Guardian's Pledge. I'm not sure what my opponent's looking for. Quicksand's pretty good. Just in case he does start to attack, I can use Quicksand. Probably on the Lone Missionary or that other soldier guy he's got. Crax's clue goes up to four cards. If we if we draw Guardian's Pledge, we're in really good shape. Squadron Hawk is a really good draw for the opponent. I really I really wish he hadn't have drawn that. Now he can play a bunch of Squadron Hawks here. We're gonna go ahead and yield until the turn because he's gonna do a lot of stuff here. Oh, what was that? When he enters the battlefield, you may search your library for any number of cards called okay reveal it and okay so he got a bunch of those things all right gather the townsfolk hmm okay we can go ahead and cast that gain two life 
and pass the turn. So every creature our opponent plays, he takes damage. What do we have here? When there's a battlefield, you may return target permanent to its owner's hand. Alright, he's going to kill one of my flyers probably here. That's unfortunate. Oh, he he didn't choose one of my creatures. He chose a missionary. Okay, he goes back up to 20. And was this a Scaldron Hawk? Yep. All right. Does he attack? He's starting to attack. Hmm. If I flip this Luma Thread field, I can block these guys and Yep, I think that's I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna flip this so that I can kill those skyfishers. So it's two to flip. Go to blocks. Oh wow, okay. <laughs> He didn't like that flip, did he? Ooh, there was my Guardian's Pledge. Right there. Next draw. Alright. Go to sideboarding. Pretty happy with my current board state. Um, I've seen more of his deck, though, but I don't think I really need anything else. The, the armorers aren't terrible. Hmm... Javelin ears aren't bad. He has a lot of X1 creatures. I think I'm pretty happy with what we have. It's really... If, if I have a decent opening hand, then my game's going to be pretty competitive. This is a decent opening hand. It's not bad. It's got three lands. It's got spells. It's got stuff for his uh, core skyfishers. I can, I can do this. Opponent goes down to six. Keeps his hand. Puts card at the bottom. That's a good sign. Planes into Bone Splitter. And we'll do planes into Javelin Ears. Pass the turn. Uh, okay. Return. Okay. Probably going to return this guy. That's not too bad. Oh, it's a permanent U control. Okay. I didn't read that at first. It's permanent U control. We'll play a planes. And I suppose we'll use raise the alarm at end of turn. If he block if if he attacks, um I'm probably gonna a block and tap to trade. Equips the bow. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna block. I'm not gonna take four every turn. Yep. Go to blocks. And then I'm going to uh, tappy. Alright. Yeah, I, I don't want to take that four damage there. What's the follow up? Core Sky Fisher. Yep. Bounces a planes. We're going to go raise the alarm. Take our turn. Play quicksand. And I think we're just going to journey that. Yeah. I don't want that skyfisher running rampant. And we'll attack in for two. And pass the turn. See what our opponent's got. We've got another journey. Sorry, even Inspector. All right. Let's see if he cracks this clue. Nope. Oh, he does crack the clue. Wow. He's really trying to dig for some stuff. Back to us. What do we got? Hermosian Rally. Hmm. I think I'm just going to play the Luma Thread Field face down. Hmm. Hmm. 
Yeah, I think that's probably the best route. I'm not going to journey a Thraben Inspector. Let's go like this. Play face down. Pass the turn. we got to deal with that Thraben Inspector, though, in some fashion. Because I don't want to not be attacking. And he scoops it up. Wow. Okay. We had some pretty good cards coming up, too. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. Uh, the game one was pretty tough because of that bad opening hand, but we managed to pull through. Comment below if you like the deck. Give a thumbs up so I know you like it and want to see more of it. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day.